Roberto, what have you said to your players after that? Well, uh, a real, a real um, contrast. Uh, the first half, I thought they played really, really well, and the players gave everything. And I felt that we were very unlucky to go uh, one nil down. But then, uh, obviously, it's, it's two different games. Once, once we can, we went three nil down. It probably we gave everything, and it was too difficult for us mentally to, to maintain the concentration. And for me, obviously, the, 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 the results are painful, but I'm not taking that into into the performance. Today, the performance until until 3 nearly if we won was completely different, something that we got to build on. And what we need now is just the window to close and, and work every day. And, and uh, Are you angry at that, though? I mean, four goals now, six goals. Are you angry with that? Are you hurt by it? Of course we are. We are hurt. And the players are hurt, first and foremost. But this, we, we need to understand the reasons. I can't fault the, 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 the effort of the players and the, and the good football in the first half. It's, and you need to, you need to be um, a little bit realistic in, in, in reading the game. 6-0 is not, it's not what, it, what it reflects. Uh, but it's, it's understanding how we can correct that and, and making sure that we've got something to build on. Do these score lines start to cause you a concern at some point? At what point do they cause you a concern? No, we have to, we have to correct them. But obviously... <laughs> If you think uh, the, the reality is that you lose a game and, and you don't get points, it doesn't matter uh, what the scoreline is, if we can correct it. Uh, I'm taking many, many positives of the first half. And it, it sounds stupid that we can, uh, that you cannot, uh, in, in a way, you cannot get the performance uh, reflected in the scoreline. Carlo, you said you can't score six goals every week yesterday. Your players proved you wrong today. Uh -huh. well, it was a tough game until uh, we had a lot of difficulty in the first half. Uh, we can play it very well, put strong press, maybe they use uh, a lot of energy in the first half and the, the second half was more, more, uh, more easier for us. And uh, the second half was very good, but for the first half uh, the, the, the match was, uh, was open. As an Italian who's grown up with a defensive style of football in Italy, is it surprising to you to see this many goals scored in these games? Uh, the, the, there is a different mentality, I think, that uh, we can try to, to come back in, in the match in the second half, there was uh, more space for our striker and we are doing very well in counter-attack now. Are you pleased or surprised with how your players have put uh, their disappointing World Cups behind them, some of them? Yeah, but uh, I think the World Cup was a different story. They come back uh, with a, a strong motivation and so for this season I think they are, they are playing very well. And even though it's only two games gone in the season, is goal difference already an advantage for you over Manchester United and the other title-chasing teams? Well, I, I don't think that uh, uh, this could be an advantage now. We have to, to continue to play well, to, to win, because it's important to start well this season. We are doing this. We are happy. Didier, Carlo said in his press conference yesterday that he doesn't want people to expect Chelsea to score six every week. Did you want to prove him wrong today? No, you know, we, 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 we said the same thing after the first game. And I think if we score, we scored six, but we suffered a lot in the first half. So I think the game was difficult and the fact that we scored quick in the second half made it easier for us, you know. So many of your players had what you all described as frustrating World Cups, but you come back here and straight away you seem happy, you seem settled, you seem back at the top of your game. Why is that? Oh, I think we, we know each other for such a long time, so we know what we have to do. We know what we have to do when the game is difficult, and uh, we know also what we have to do to make it easier. I think, uh, as I said last week, uh, we're going to have some difficult time, but uh, we want them to come as late as possible. And I know it's very early in the season, but already that goal difference is looking good. Do you think that could prove important at the other end of the season? I hope no. I think uh, I hope not. I mean, I think uh, it would be great if we could win the league uh, uh, with a lot of points. But uh, this league is not going to be easy. And I think uh, today uh, we can so show that uh, it's going to be difficult to come here and, and take some points. I think uh, people don't have to look at the goal difference. I think. Uh, Today we can play well the first half, the second half. I think we try to improve our game, so it's better. Well done. We wondered if you were going to get a third hat-trick in a row. You didn't get that, but you got the Barclays champagne. Man of the match, well done. Thank you. Thank you very much. Well done. Thank you.